What are we going to talk about? Uh, I wanted to talk about how Tosan got his name. Tosan got his name. Tosan gave his pen name to himself, but his real name was given him by his father. His original name was An Chi Sam. He mm -hmm. had two older brothers. I think Sam is three. Yeah. On, but Sam. I don't know why they call An Chi Ho and An Chi Young. And then they ran out of names and just called them number three. Maybe the parents were lazy. <laughs> or tired, yeah. And then, yeah, because. So start once, huh? <laughs> the sister's name is An Shin Ho. Yeah. So, oh, well, I don't know. But, anyways, the other part, well, then he changed his name to An Chang Ho. And then uh, um, that was to protect the family when he became a somewhat anti government anti-Korean government radical before becoming an anti-Japanese imperialism radical. But then Tosan, he uh, selected the name as his pen name when um, Ihe Ryun, his wife, and Tosan had left uh, Korea to come to America. And as they were sailing across the ocean, he suddenly saw uh, the island of Hawaii. They had to stop there on the way in Honolulu. And so as the ship got closer to the islands, all of a sudden Diamond Head, you know, appeared like this big mountain out of nowhere. And so, uh -huh. you know, because of the social upheaval and um, the situation he was in, uh, he knew that he was like an island in the sea of social upheaval by himself because there weren't a lot of people that were fighting the government or fighting the Japanese at the time. And so... Uh, he knew he was kind of be alone, so that's where the island part comes. And then the mountain part, you know, he knew he had to rise above everything and be strong. Yeah. And, you know, and, and, you know, it's like, also, you know, it's like Martin Luther King talks about the mountain, you know, like, you know, uh, being a mountain. Yeah, you know, or going there, getting to the mountain and climbing to the top. So it's a, a combination of a lot of symbolism. But as you learn more about Tosan, there's a lot of symbolism in his, uh, uh, life you know and yeah. his teachings and you know what he saw as he went around the world so that's how tosan got his name that's it tosan <laughs> island mountain island mountain Na hawaii, hawaii <laughs> after seeing yeah. hawaii yeah <laughs> pretty cool that you know really I, cool. I, I gave a speech i think it was in san francisco and like 1994 or 95, and some guy was trying to tell me that Tosan had never been to Hawaii. And I was just looking at him and thinking, what? He's and, an idiot. <laughs> yeah, a real pavo. And, because uh, I have, you know, pictures of him there. Um, I have pictures of him sitting with uh, just these huge, beautiful lays. And, uh, Which we'll put up right now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we have pictures of everything yeah. almost. All right, so I think that's, that's it for Tosan's name. That's it. Join us more for more videos on Tosada and Korean American history. Thanks.